Fidel Amir, together with other families, is about to return to his house in Sorora. During the past month, a coalition between Palestinians, Israelis, and international activists have set the Samud Freedom Camp, clearing rubble from the abandoned caves and reconstructing the road in order to make it possible for the families to come back to their homes. We believe after years of uh, struggle that unity is one of the conditions in order for us to achieve our uh, goals and our dreams. And so since then we joined together, joined forces together in order to uh, create this camp that we call it Samud, means steadfast in Arabic, working together with the local communities here in South Hebron Hills in order to help them return to their land and also to uh, send a message of non-violent and joint non-violent struggle in order to win against the darkness. That's what we do. I really think the most amazing thing that's come out of this is the community. It's been phenomenal to see Palestinians and Israelis and internationals really spending every waking minute together and living together. We've made meals together, we've slept together, we've been under the stars together, we've resisted together, we've learned from each other, we've learned Arabic and Hebrew and English and we've really, we've really gotten to know each other and to fall in love with each other I think and that's something they would say dolphin. It's a beautiful to be a part of that. Palestinians, some, many Palestinians are great people and, and they, want, they want peace and they want their story to be known. They, they have very hard hardships through the occupation and I think many Israelis need to know that and, and get together until we'll solve, we'll solve the problem because otherwise there's no solution and two nations are suffering. Sorora is one of 12 Palestinian communities in the South Hebron Hills, which was evicted in 1999 when the IDF declared their land as Firing Zone 918, a military zone for training and exercises that has not been used for this purpose ever since it was declared. Sorora is an example for resisting for many Palestinian villages in South Hebron or in Area C itself. And Sorora is an example. If the people tomorrow stay in Sarura, the owners of the land, if they stay with their families here, that means we succeed for one power. Here we do peace. We didn't wait to the governments to sign the deals for peace or sit down on the negotiation tables and then blah, blah, blah all the time. Then they back and nothing happened. But here we doing peace 